Giving back during the holiday season just got a whole lot easier. News Channel 5's Kristen Scovera checked out a new app that helps shoppers support businesses doing good. If you're going to spend money this Christmas, restaurant, groceries, um, retail stores, Planet Fundraiser wants to help you support stores that give back to causes you care about. You would download the app, it's free to download. When you open the app, it shows all of the merchants in your area uh, based on your location that give back and the percentage that they give back every day. Drew Honeycutt is the co-founder of Planet Fundraiser. Um, so 90% of Americans will change brands to align themselves with a brand that cares about what they care about. Honeycutt says shoppers want to give back and now it's as easy as taking a picture on their smartphone. You shop there, you take a picture of your receipt, submit it through our app and when you do, the percentage shown on the app goes back to the calls that you've selected. This is the future of how we how we give and how our children are going to give. Nashville's oh, Annie White is a busy mom of three. She says using the app helps her find stores in her area, giving to causes near and dear to her heart. Having the app um, it definitely makes it easy to give back. I, I feel like as moms, we're rushing around. There's a lot going on and it's hard to kind of give your time is what you want to do to certain causes, schools. But um, right now in my life in this phase, the best thing I can do is kind of print the, print, you know, take a copy of my receipt and, and give that way. And it's not just for shoppers. Any business, big or small, can use the app to find out what their customers care about and give back in kind. This is for any business that is looking for a way to uh, give back to the community, to deepen loyalty with their customers. Kristen Scovira, News Channel 5. The app is free and it's available in the App Store or on Google Play. We've got more details on the website, newchannel5.com.